Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Blocks the shot. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Oh, outstanding placement as he lands the knee to the body. Again, the taller fighter making noise with a knee strike there. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Back and forth we go here! He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Just over three minutes to go. Let's get behind that jab now. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Nice looping punch. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. I mean, that right hand landed square. Missed with that right hand. Relax, relax. Keep your hands up. Now. Take it off. There's no tell on that leg kick. Well placed kick there by Lee. Way to hide that leg kick. Final seconds of round one. Round two straight ahead. A lot of high-level highlights from that last round. DC, take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Nice punch there by Lee. Oh, big head kick. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Strike. They continue to exchange. Put your hands up higher. Come on. Right hand on point. Real quick leg kick. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. Little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Wow, what a kick. That one was thrown to end 
the fight. Yep. <laughs> Just missed with that right hand. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively. He does a great job of moving his head side to side and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Wow. Oh, he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Big kick lands. Oh. He's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Punch coming, it's blocked. 20 seconds left in the round. 20 seconds left. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, next round is now underway. Previous round, not necessarily a tough act to follow. Pretty good round. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Got the turtle in that kick. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. Oh, misses with the jab. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, nice offering there with the knee. He talked to us a lot about that on Thursday. Felt like the knees would be there. It was certainly there on that exchange. He knew they would be available. He just knew he would have to find the right opportunity and right time to land those strikes. Ooh, big shot lands. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he don't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it, lighten up his opponent left and right. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw a knee. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's going to give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Ooh, what a head kick. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh, yeah, right hand. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Now connects with a right. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Final seconds of the fight. So the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job 
of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. I'm liable to trip, I ain't popping no pill, but you do as you wish. I roll with some fiends, I love them to death, I got 